My name is Riccardo Zoccarato and I'm a project engineer of the System Dynamics team of EngineSoft. Today, uh, I will talk about how to improve and speed up the design and testing process of a forklift truck by using Recudine Powerful Technology. So I would start the presentation by giving you a, a brief introduction to Recudine and its capabilities. Then we will see uh, how Recudine can reproduce an experimental validation test through multi-body dynamic analysis by taking advantage of his unique tools, its premium contact technology, then its multi-flexible body capabilities, and finally, its tire models. Finally, I would give an answer to all of your possible questions. So let's start. Um, in order to introduce Recudine, I would say that it is a software for simulating the dynamics of uh, rigid multi-body uh, systems um, that has many other tools on the market, but with many, many more capabilities. In fact, Recudine can simulate uh, flexible bodies and contacts between bodies like no one else can, and this thanks to its unique technology. Also, it is uh, faster and faster than any other competitor because of its optimized solver. Another interesting fact is that Recudine allows integrated particle simulation in order to simulate the coupled dynamics of a mechanical system and a granular flow, or the dynamics of a, a mechanical system coupled to uh, the, the, the fluid, uh, coupled to a fluid like water or lubricating oil. In addition, Recudine is strongly customizable via uh, Visual Basic or C Sharp macros. Anyway, um, today I will focus on a specific test case that is the simulation of a forklift dynamics. And um, so through multiple simulations, I will apply and show to you some of Recordine's most interesting tools. So uh, the design of a, a modern forklift is a long and tricky process. That's because of the uh, uh, strict regulations and high performance requirements. Then in order to be validated, a prototype has to overcome multiple experimental tests. Uh, the, and then the, the failure of, uh, of one single of these of this tests, um, of course, involves uh, design modifications, deep design modifications, with unavoidable, unavoidable project delays and of course, an exponential increase in development costs. In particular, one of the validation tests involves the forklift truck proceeding uh, at about 10 kilometers uh, per hour, constant velocity, and, uh, and crossing a test obstacle uh, placed on its way. As you can see from this video, um, an obstacle can seriously compromise the stability of, of a forklift, and, and of course, also the integrity of the, the carried freight. So this test <clears throat> is, uh, is essential for the, for, for the validation of a forklift prototype. Well, uh, with Recordine, we can perfectly reproduce this test, and this is why we have built the model you can see here. Um, this forklift uh, has been represented with uh, rigid bodies interacting uh, with contact features. In particular, a set of contact features has been created between the forks and the pallet so that the freight is uh, free to move based on the forklift dynamics. A dedicated set of frictional contact features um, interface the wheels with the ground. In this case, uh, so many contact features could make a motor body model very difficult to simulate for a, a competitor software. But let's see uh, what Rikudan can do in contact simulation. Okay, all the contact features applied in the following simulations uh, use Recodine's proprietary uh, contact technology. Here you can see the representation of the contact feature that interfaces one of the wheels with the obstacle. This feature that is called uh, geosurface contact has been des uh, designed to be both powerful and efficient. It can simulate every kind of contact force between the two bodies thanks to its complex formulation, 
including both contact stiffness and contact damping. Also, the friction forces uh, are reproduced by applying the correct static and dynamic friction coefficients. This sophisticated contact is, is made extremely efficient by Ricudine's uh, smart contact management, so that finally we are able to simulate models with thousands of contact features. No, no other multibody software on the market can do the same. So uh, we have performed, in this case, a, a seven second simulation, and these are the results we have obtained. This analysis has finished in just 12 minutes, running on a standard uh, workstation, as you can see. And of course, the output is, is very rich. We can analyze in detail the forklift dynamics and understand if this design uh, provides the required stability in handling. The blue, the blue vector uh, in the video represents the, the, the contact forces between freight and forks, and also between wheels and ground. The video shows that uh, when the forklift crosses the obstacle, then the freight jumps and shakes, but uh, finally it stabilizes on the forks. Of course, at 10 kilometers per hour speed, this, this impact could uh, compromise the freight integrity. So this simulation uh, gives to us another precious output. In fact, all the loads between the parts of the forklift are measured during the multibody dynamic analysis. And then they can be used in a finite element analysis for the structural verification of the forklift. In particular, uh, um, I am now showing to you the MBD forensics tool. That is an integration of this tool allows the automatic transfer, transfer of uh, all the dynamic loads measured during the multibody analysis into a static structural analysis. To verify the specific component, you just need to, to mesh the part and solve to finally obtain the stress results you have seen in the video. Okay, let's change topic. So when the deformation of a part influences the system dynamics, that part has to be modeled as a flexible body. In this case, Ricodyne offers the opportunity to take uh, into account every possible nonlinear behavior of a flexible body and this with its unique full flex technology. By representing the flexible bodies with its um, finite elements, the full flex technology provides an efficient integration of the finite element analysis in Ricodyne multi-body simulation. This approach is called multi-flexible body dynamics and allows the simulation of flexible bodies with nonlinear deformations, materials, with nonlinear properties, and finally also contacts over deformable surfaces. So, um, for example, with moving or enlarging interfaces. Then, I would like to show to you um, these capabilities of the full flex technology by applying it uh, on the forklift multi-body multi model. For this reason, we have modeled the forklift mast as a flexible subsystem composed by two parts. The inner mast you can see in orange and then the outer mast that you can see in blue. The two parts are interfaced one with the other by contact features and so they will bend under the loads coming from the forks and the vehicles. Um, this would be, uh, I can say, a, a, th a tough a transient analysis in a common finite element simulation environment. But let's see what happens in Ricodyne. This time, the same forklift, forklift simulation has required about 23 hours of computation time, of course. And um, this always on a standard workstation. I can assure you that uh, this is a ridiculous 
computation time if compared to the days of calculations that would be required to perform the same transient analysis, but in a standard finite element simulation environment. Moreover, no convergence problems affect the, the Rikudai multibody solver, so that uh, our model will always finish the simulation without any unwanted stop. So finally, we can analyze in the videos the Formises equivalent stress over <clears throat> the, the mass deformed bodies. And also, at the same time, we can observe how the flexibility influences the, the Foucault dynamics. In particular, you can see that the flexible must has produced um, an increase in the freight shakes, uh, while the forklift loads has uh, slightly decreased. The last special uh, feature of Ricodyne that I would like to, to show to you is the tired model. Indeed, the dynamics of a vehicle are strongly influenced by the, the interaction between the wheels and the ground. And in particular, the characteristics of two different tires can totally change the dynamic performance of the, the same identical vehicle. Therefore, <clears throat> Rikudain offers many, many different uh, models that describe precisely and efficiently the behavior of a tire, including the tire model, uh, for example, of the University of Arizona and the Fiala mo tire model. Of course, all of these tire models uh, take advantage of Rikudain's uh, premium contact technology. So now we come back to the rigid body model, and this time we remove the existing uh, wheels, and instead we insert four wheels model with the tire model, uh, in this case of the University of Arizona. The tire model has been tuned uh, based on experimental data coming from tire characterization. Again, um, we have repeated the seven seconds simulation involving the, the forklift crossing the, the obstacle. And this time the simulation required only 45 seconds of computation time. This because, um, because, because of the, the high efficiency of the applied tire model. Moreover, uh, Rikudine produces uh, with colored vector um, a, a clear representation of the, the forces and torques um, acting on the different wheels. So finally, inserting the tire model, we have, uh, of course, improved the forklift simulation by reproducing the true dynamics of the wheels and, and finally globally uh, smoothing the, the, the global uh, vehicle dynamics. I am sorry, uh, there is no, okay, I cannot find the, the final slides with the, the conclusions. It, it's not this, but I can say um, with, with words what I would like to, to explain to you. So the conclusions, again, the design of a forklift is, is a long and difficult process because of uh, strict regulations and performance requirements. Um, every prototype has to overcome multiple experimental tests for its validation, and the failure of a single one of these tests involves uh, design modifications with uh, unavoidable project delays and, of course, exponential increase in development costs. In this complex project environment, Rikudine becomes a unique ally. Indeed, uh, from the early stages of the development of a forklift truck, uh, the multibody dynamics uh, simulation with Rikudine enables uh, a simultaneous verification of the final product performance. And this by driving the design through the best concept selection up to the final prototype validation. At each project step, Rikudine simulation environment provides unique tools that allows um, that allow a faithful reproduction of the required experimental tests. Uh, tests that can, that can be like handling tests, stability tests, or rollover tests. And so finally, providing essential information to the designer. 
This casts product development costs by preventing deep project modification and by dramatically reducing the number of required prototypes and experimental tests. 